In our previous video, we looked at how enable broadening and disable keyword search can help you adjust the number of jobs that are returned from a search. Let's talk about two more options, featured jobs and custom ranking, to further influence your search results. First up, you have the ability to feature a job by setting a promotion value. This is a property actually attached to each individual job posting. When performing a search request against the API, you can filter if you want only featured jobs to be returned. Using featured jobs allows you to highlight jobs that are important in terms of your business needs. Any featured jobs are returned in order of promotion value. If multiple jobs have the same promotion value, the relevance of the job listing is used as a tiebreaker. However, it's important to balance not only how you're showing featured jobs, but also ensuring the relevance of search results. If you only show featured jobs which are ordered by your promotion value, you may not be returning the highest quality matches for a search request. This means that the user may not be exactly seeing the best experience and could have lower engagement. So it's important to balance your implementation with the number and presentation of featured jobs. Also, when searching for featured jobs, you can use Enable Broadening so you have expanded query results that come back when doing a search request. One important note is that we recommend not using featured jobs when disable keyword match is set to false. This can lead to a featured job being promoted when it could be fairly irrelevant to the user's query. For example, if you've featured a job for a software engineer with a server administration in the description and someone searches for a restaurant server, they may see this software engineering job as the top match. With keyword matching, this job fits the criteria, and coupled with being featured, it might end up towards the top and provide a poor experience for the user. Again, it's important to make sure the configuration makes sense for your use cases and that you test to get the best results. Featured jobs lets you split off certain jobs to be returned separately, but you can also use custom ranking to influence the order in which jobs are returned. Custom ranking can be done through an expression where you create a formula to influence the ordering of results. These formulas can involve simple math and custom attributes for jobs, which we'll talk a bit more about in the next video. When setting a custom ranking formula, the jobs in the search result will get returned according to your formula, giving you more control over ordering them. Based on the way you want jobs to return and to keep job search results relevant, you should use featured jobs or custom ranking. However, we don't really recommend using both at the same time. They're both powerful tools to give you the customization support to meet your business logic, but they're two ways of solving the same problem, so using them at the same time can be hard to manage and give confusing results for your users. Featured jobs and custom ranking, along with broadening and keyword matching, are major ways to configure and tweak the results that come back from the Job Search API. In our next video, we'll look at some more configuration options that are a bit smaller and best practices to keep in mind when you're testing out your integration. Thanks for watching, and remember, when looking for talent, it's okay to keep your head in the cloud.